Some people living in an East Austin apartment complex have been forced to leave their apartments after a fire at the Miller Flats apartments late last night. Fortunately, no one was hurt, but the rebuilding process is going to take some time. Tonight, KVU's Kelsey Sanchez spoke with some of the neighbors who were affected. Blair Hicks is saying goodbye to a place he's called home for about eight years. Well, I was scared out of my mind. I mean, I'm really lucky. I hope everyone else is as lucky as I was. According to the Austin Fire Department, around 1030 Wednesday night, fire ripped through Miller Flats apartments, damaging a dozen units and forcing at least 10 people out. I woke up about midnight and it was honestly, it was more the fire trucks than anything. I didn't really smell anything, but as soon as I was up, power was off. There were fire trucks. If you imagine this like a city block, like a block and a half of just fire trucks and it was still smoldering. Investigators say the fire started on a third floor balcony after someone threw away smoky material. Hicks says his apartment wasn't one of the ones affected, but others were left in shambles. I feel bad for folks that I mean, there's families in some of these units, like little one bedroom units, and they've got nothing. I'd put them in the U-Haul if they asked. Hicks says he was given five hours to move out and is supposed to get information about where he can go soon. I'm sure later I'll be real angry and sad and stuff, but you have five hours, you can do what you can with five hours. And as Hicks packs up, he says for now, he's lucky he has friends and options. I'm going to be okay, but it was really, it's really scary. I'm sure I haven't processed it yet. And thankfully, no one living here was hurt. In East Austin, I'm Kelsey Sanchez.